Hello, everybody. This is a tutorial to help you understand a little bit more about the display and brightness settings on your iPad. This is another way you can customize your iPad to the way that works best for you. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to click on settings so that we can get to those different functions there. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that. We will scroll down until we see display and brightness. And when you see that there, we'll go through just a few of the options here that you have available uh, so you can customize your iPad. The first one is the appearance. So right now my iPad is currently in the dark mode. You can switch easily back and forth between the two. Depends on your preference of what you would like the iPad to look like. Then you do have a toggle bar there that says automatic. What that will do is that will set it up to be in the dark mode at certain times and the lighter mode at other times. So right now, I currently have that toggled on. You then have options. So right now mine's set to be dark until sunrise. You can also change that if you'd like to. You can create a custom schedule for yourself if you want it to change in between light and dark. Also, you have the night shift. So what that does is that dims the light during the evening time. So when you're reading, it's a little bit easier for you to be able to see. You then have the auto lock. So what that's going to do is that is actually going to lock your iPad during that specified time that you have there. So currently mine is set to 10 minutes. The faster it does go into lock mode, more likely the battery will be able to be saved more. So it just depends on what you would like for your iPad to do. That's another way you can customize it. You also have a choice down here at the very bottom to decide on the text size of your iPad. So we'll go ahead and click on that. Mine is about halfway right now. You can move it up to be able to make the text bigger or down to make the text smaller. And as you can see, my iPad is changing text size as we do that. The last thing on here is bold text. If that's something that would help you, you can certainly bold the text on your iPad. It just makes it a little bit more dark and bolded with the lettering there. So I hope this helps with understanding the display and brightness on your iPad.